Bread Comes to Life, A Garden of Wheat and a Loaf to Eat, by George Levinson, photographed by Schmiel Thaler. Bread is the food we eat every day, so many kinds, so many ways. White bread, black bread, small bread, tall bread, thin bread, twin bread, dinner rolls, bread with holes, hard day old, tough bread, soft, squishy, fluff bread. Bread is toast, bread is crumbs, bread is pizza, bread is buns. How is bread made? Where is it from? This baker makes his bread from scratch by sowing wheat in his backyard patch. Soon those seeds send down roots and sprout into shots of bright green grass. The days pass and that grass grows into sturdy blades, tall and straight, finely made, with budding heads and bristly hair, gently wave in the air. When the crop is ripe and old, the tops are bowed and stricked with gold, and every head of wheat contains many tiny finished grains. Time to cut the golden field, gather up the backyard yield, stack up piles of sun-dried stalks, rub them in threshing box. It's the simple old-time miller's craft of separating wheat and chaff. What's left? Our seeds a hefty load, many times the, the number sowed, and each new grain of harvest wheat looks like a loaf to eat. Now is the hour to grind those grains into whole wheat flour. With simple tools and easy rules, it's on the show to make up some dough and fresh bread to life. Yeast, honey, water, flour, salt, oil, and muscle powder. Dump it, thump it, dust it, knead it. Squash it, stretch it, toss it. Set it aside to rest and rise. It grows and grows to twice the size. Punch it down, give it some shape, let it rise again, but put it in to bake. Slice it fresh, it's better than cake. Whatever the shape it finally takes, wherever the place it finally bakes. Every day we are blessed with a mountain of bread, it's the staff of life. May we all be fed.